Hello, MacWarriors! How is it going? And welcome to another episode of MacWarrior 5 Mercenaries Legend of the Castral Lancers. We are in the middle of a flashpo flashpoint? I was kind of going for Battletech here, but you know what? We have one of these uh, special missions coming from Heroes of the Inner Sphere, that is the former DLC. But I want to I wanna be here because I want to get the Hero Mech and I want to see what we can do with it. So, let me take a look at my Battle Mechs. They got a little bit of a beating last time we were playing them, especially the Orion. So we need to repair all... Replace that LRM-20 with a bigger one. A better one? The Artemis one? No. No, that's that's definitely a no. I'm not gonna do that. That thing will fall apart as well. And I do not have Artemis ammo currently, right? I mean, if I go Artemis, I think I'm gonna go Artemis with two LRM-20 launchers. Or maybe a 15 and a 20. Just going all in because Artemis is so heavy. And just for one launcher? Does it make sense? Uh, there's a lot of debate here that we can have, but I think I think I'm gonna put an LRM 15 on this. Well, let's take a look at the market. Maybe there's something on the market that we can take. Yeah, it's only 15s here. Mm -hmm -hmm. Maybe this the Artemis. This mech is coldish, ish. Give me, give me a second. Where was my ammo anyway? We have half a ton here. Oh, there's two tons there. All right, got it. So repair that, drop that. Can we go for it? We might. We might be able to do it. You know what? If we lose that 20, it's gonna be all right. We gotta drop the LRM Artemis, though. Uh, the, the regular ones, because we need uh, Artemis ammo. And now we are half a ton over. Can we get away with only half a ton of SRM ammo? I think the answer is yes. We could also give this guy double heat sinks. I think that's how I want to play this. Yeah, we have two tons of ammo now. A half ton of Artemis would be uh, extremely good, but I guess I'll just give it a third ton. And then we add another double... Double heat sink here. It's a bit it's a bit wacky in terms of build, but I think it's gonna be alright. So we made the mech a little bit colder even than it was before. And we managed to wait so that we now have an Artemis. I mean, why not? Just good old 75 days. It's beautiful. Absolutely fantastic. Now, where do we want to go now? We're going to go down here. We're going to play some missions at Grand Base. Grand Base? Grand Base? Grand? Grand? I don't know. Grand? It's Grand, Grand Base. It's French. This, this is how it is. Let's go. Play the next mission. Gonna use our good old Black Knight, I think. Or maybe we are using the Stalker for a little bit of a change up here. Why not? Why not? We can probably do that. Right, we're gonna accept the missions that we have, and then of course we're gonna play the campaign mission that is the Will of Kali. And I'm gonna go with all the salvage that we can muster, because uh, that's important. Wanna get those sweet, sweet double heat sinks and uh, the good old Lost Tech stuff. I also take the stalks. Um, you know what? It's fine, we're gonna wait to 75 days, or 62 at this point. Again, we want to waste some time. Hashtag, get into uh, Steiner Davian Liaison. Because this is where we... I hope we get uh, some new missions from the DLC that we have not played before. Alrighty. Good old Stalker on the board. Oh man, I haven't played that in a while. It is currently set up as a missile boat. It's four LRM-10s and some medium lasers to get the mech into a bit of a defensive state when we need it. Okay, Commander. Our employer believes that Whitby and her closest lieutenants are stationed somewhere here on yeah, cool. Base. They want us to stomp out this sect before their proclamations draw unwanted attention to the world. So we are playing an assassination Let's mission, so it seems. All Interesting. Are making me uneasy. Sure. We're gonna go for this thing first, before we go over there, because uh, we have the better angle on this here. We have the high ground here, we might be able to just lob some missiles over their heads and, and just get some damage in before they can attack us. And I hope that we don't have to push down, because that might trigger the other base as well. And having two enemies, or two sets of enemies attacking us at the same time, is a thing that I want to try to avoid. Alright, here we go. Highlander! Highlander. Oh, it was that mission. Oh, yeah, there will be a dropship. There will be a dropship later. Targets. Yo, guys, you stay with me. Don't go down. Don't go down there. This is not advised. Uh-huh. 
They go Igors, but not for long. Down he goes. Got that thing. And here is... Uh, it's not the Highlander, actually. It is another guy. How our Ryan is gonna get wrecked if we leave him down there. I think we're gonna set the attack command and then we're gonna get him back. Alright, here it is. Here it is. Go for the Kintaro. Go for it now. Oh, Orion is getting shot in the back now. Um, I hope it's fine. You want me? Come at me, bro. Come at me. Oh, this needs to go. I hope it's enough. Just want to manage my heat a little bit. And that's a turret. We gotta be really smart about this. We go, got that thing. And now it is Kintaro time. Couldn't quite get him. Oh! The kill commander. Critical explosion imminent. Cool. So we got it done so far. We have our high ground advantage and we made use of that. Got some carriers down there. Yeah, I'm gonna go for them first because the Highlander has some time. Target destroyed. Getting those sweet, sweet quick kills. And is it time to go down now? We destroyed most of the enemies. I'm a bit afraid of the Highlander and what else might come. He's running a Gauss rifle. <laughs> Don't go for me. Scrap that one. It might be time. All right, I'm gonna set the attack command. Let's go. He's already softened up big time. That's beautiful. Are once again using mechs equipped with Star League era lost tech. Star League era lost tech. Is he down? We got our main guy. Wait. Good job. Wait, that's it? That's as much as we can do here, Commander. Uh, well, if he I mean, appear to be here, we could go now. We could fight this. Hold on. Something's interfering with our comms. Yeah, we're gonna go for this. Hag has sent her lap dogs to snuff out what she knows to be true. But my vision is the only true path for the church. Who's that? And soon she will witness my ascension as the true avatar of He's Kali. gonna get destroyed. To you, I say this. Somebody's Please interfering with my sensors here. Masters. Inform them that their time has come. For soon they will bow to me. And who's that? Target acquired. Oh, that was the, yeah, 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 the, the person who kind of started their own cult or something, right? Kind of a splinter group from their religious whatever. Eat critical. Eat critical. Ah, let's go. Ah, I should, should have chain fired. The missiles will lose their locks if I shut down. Obviously. But hey, we made it without big casualties here. And we might get something from the battlefield that is in the shape of a Gauss rifle. It would be so cool to have one. That would be a real game changer because then we can start building those headshot mechs. We need the proper mech for it, sure, but it's gonna be amazing. That was a quick and easy mission. Right. Let's keep going. Let's keep doing the things that we are doing here. Target acquired. We got that guy. And I mean, the Stalker is just such a beautiful mech. It has so much firepower. It could need a little bit more heat management. That's that's right. Target destroyed. I could make it my main mech and give it a lot of heat management. I mean, we got some doubles lying around, so might as well put some into the mechs that we are running most of the time. And again, the Stalker is going to be such an asset over the course of this whole campaign. He's going to be... Or it's going to be... Um, it's gonna be on the battlefield a lot. Problem that I'm seeing with it is just, it's just so slow. That's the problem. No, okay, he's out. The will of Kali is not going to like that. We'll extract you now, Commander. Unfortunately, our business with these zealots is not over yet. Not over yet. All right, let's get out of here. Let's get into the next part of the mission. And that's gonna be interesting. Since, uh, oh, sorry for the ping. That was my Facebook. What's my Facebook doing here? Get out of here, Facebook. 
I don't want you here. Here we go. Um, what I wanted to say is... What is it that I wanted to say? It's going to be interesting because... Because we cannot pick this guy. We cannot pick this guy. We could pick a champion. Coming with a Gauss and an ERPPC. That's a Gauss tier 2, though. I think I pick both of them and ammunition and then build something with it. That makes the most sense. I really hope we get some ammo. There is two bins only. That feeds just one ballistic. But I guess we're just gonna, you know, take a look around and see if we can find some ammo for it. I'm gonna also take the SRMs, the AC5, medium laser, T4 is sadly not in our reach anymore, but that's okay. I think this is the best that we can get. Absolutely. Wait a sec. Was I missing double heat sinks? No, not really. Alright, so we're gonna take that. If you play the Will of Kali, again, go for Salvage, because you get so much, so much good stuff here. So, what's going on next? Warning, hazardous terrain. Alright. Jump capabilities and heat efficient loadouts are advised. Got it. So, I think our Black Knight will be good here. What about the Stalker? What about it, guys? Should we go for... Uh, I want to repair you. Uh, should we go for a double heat sink build here? I guess we could do that. Um, obviously, we're gonna put the doubles into the side torso so that they are a bit better protected. Jump capacity and heat efficient loadouts are advised. Honestly, I cannot remember the mission anymore, but that's okay. Is this the best way to get some doubles in here? Alright, one in here. I don't know, in the arm. Yeah, I think this is how we play it. It's 30 days, but whatever, it's fine. We got some eggs and cold storage that we can sell at any point. Alright, heat efficient loadouts. I, uh, poof, hmm, hmm, hmm. I guess the Orion is fine. The Archer is fine. Rifleman is okay. Maybe these guys are still the best one that we have. Alright. Let's go. Do we go to Klaxon already? Wait a second. Wait a second. Wait a second. Um, first of all... There is a cantina. Alright. So it's not here on our planet. But we have some contracts here. But these are really bad. So we are not taking them. They are very low tier. Let's go to Claxton. This is where we want to go. Alright, so... The Stalker is not going to be ready unless we wait for it, and I think we will. Again, spending time in space is what we are here for. We've got to wait for that beautiful marriage. Alright, here we are. Why do we need to be jump capable again? Oh, wait a second. I think I, I know what we are up against. Yeah, I'm going to play my Black Knight. I think this is going to be alright. Um, alright, we're gonna also take the Salvage. And I do believe it is the Orion that we will fight here in the end. Alright, I'll take you, Pikachu. This is okay. This is also okay. That's how we play it. Ready up, everybody. We're going in. So this is kind of like this volcanic mission where you have a bunch of different bases uh, and then you, you go up the spiral at the end to, to kind of like a spire situation while you're on top of everything and there's a very dense brawly situation. Which means I should not have taken my long range mechs necessarily. But hey, we just use them as meat shields and we're gonna blast the enemies with our large lasers. Yeah. Alright, let's see. Sensors online. Weapons online. All systems nominal. All systems phenomenal. It confirms the Whitby stronghold is here in this remote, uninhabited volcanic region. What's with the glass? Getting to here was easy enough. The That's real weird. problem will be getting to her. You have one primary objective here, Commander. Where? Take Whitby out. All right, uh, I'll take her That's out. Strange. But 
Commander, what's going on with the glass? Does not appear in the system's charts. In fact, I'm detecting several more large structures like it in the area. Something doesn't seem right here. Good shot. So, is it the heat that is melting my glass right now, or what is that? Uh, what is going on here, by the way? I have the feeling that the minimap is off sync. There's something weird. Alright. Those bridges must have been destroyed by the heretics. You should be able to clear it using your jump jets. My jump jets! Oh, we just move around them. That's also possible. No big deal. Yeah, I'm completely off the minimap. That's so weird. It's really hard to assess where my friends are. Uh, can I? Can I get around here? Yeah, I can. So, this is not even a problem. I mean, jump jets are nice, but they're just nice to have. You get that guy, right? Scrap that one. Good job, everybody. Good job. Now, follow me. Oh, that's a mech. Hello, Phoenix Hawk. I gotta be careful with my damage that I'm taking in the early encounters, though. Because this is kind of a lengthy mission. Alright, so he's down. Follow me. Yeah, you got this. Great. And again, it's a kind of like a dense-ish scenario here with lots of tunnels. I should have taken some more brawly mechs in general. Oh. Little tank. Little tank is gone. This is super distracting with the glass. And again, I'm not entirely sure if that's supposed to be like that or if that's a bug. And I think we need to stick to the low ground here. What are you? You are dead. That's what you are. Oh, yes. Sweep the leg. I'm gonna leave it to my friends. Nice. Anyway, what happens if I go to this and then back? Well, still the same thing. Target acquired. Kapow. Target oh, that's Target a that's dervish. a mech. That's a dervish. Actually, should we just go for his legs? I think that's what we're gonna be doing. Honestly, no, at this point, it's just center mass. And that's it. But yet again, I'm taking far too much damage. I'm gonna stay a little bit in the back. Hunchback, by the way, horribly headshot. So we're gonna follow up on that. Nice. Beautiful, guys. That was an efficient kill. Perfect. We're moving into position. Yeah, I think we're gonna just use waypoints here so that I'm not the one to engage first most of the time. It's okay if I do it occasionally, but... Positioning on you, Commander. Let's see. Ah oh, man, the minimap. I always get tricked by the minimap. I thought my people were ahead of me and then I was looking and Brianna, are you seeing this? they were not. A Union dropship completely embedded inside these mountains. Looks like you've seen better days. I'll run an analysis. In the meantime, nah. watch your back. I my back? I should watch my front. Season. Got him though. Whoa. That was good. Quick kills. That's what we need here, guys. Alright. Man, that Union dropship. That's where they got all of their um, SLDF lost tech from. I'm gonna send my people over there. I want them to engage first, you know. Stalker and Awesome are completely, completely uh, fresh still. Okay. So what's happening here? Um, seems like there's no engagement. Oh, there is. Never mind. Aha! Take that, Mr. Hawk. There we go. And he's almost down. Don't explode. No, he's not exploding. Perfect. Uh, the Orion, however, got a little bit of damage on the left arm. Huh. Not, not really pleased with that. We'll take Irby. Definitely. That's a solid hit. Great. Let's keep going. We got some turrets. We got some 
Um, let me think. We gotta go up to the high ground, right? That's where we got to go? We could always drop. But I think being here is good. Having the high ground overwatching the canyon is always better than being in that canyon. It could be a death trap. Although... Although, no. This is the faster way to victory, so we're gonna go down there. A little bit of leg damage. With you. Alrighty. Ah, <laughs> big volcano. What about these guys? Can you can you come down here, guys? Are you fine? Are you good? Are you able to maneuver? It seems like it. This, this is not, not over, not even close. Look at where we are right now. There is so much on this map. Target acquired. Target destroyed. So we gotta really use our resources wisely. That is armor and firepower and ammunition in general. Moving out. They seem to be distracted by some turrets still. But it looks cool. That's the thing I can tell you already. I like the Stalker. It's still so packed with weapons. I love it. Nice. Alright, so everybody's here. Relocated. And I can smell the blood of our enemies. Mm, Try is... to avoid the lava as much as possible, Commander. Yeah, I, I do. In it will raise your heat levels considerably. No shit, Rihanna. Mechs equipped with jump jets ought to be able to clear gaps with ease, provided you regulate your fuel properly. <laughs> Best not to overdo it. Alright, here we go. This seems like a big ambush situation. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna hold it here. Wait for my people to get over it. Oh my god, you are the smartest people in the world crossing the lava directly. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Well then, I didn't hire them for being smart, I did hire them for their accuracy. The funny thing is, I think we have to go down here. Yeah. By the location, Commander. So, I gotta get into the lava myself. Lead us, and let us unleash bloodshed on those in our path. That's where we need to go. It's kind of funny that we were running through the lava here, but nothing really contested us. Ask your mic. There was nothing, nobody. So it didn't really matter if we went into the lava or not. There were like two turrets? Come on. Send me a real opponent. Oh, there it is. There it is. Coming out of nowhere. Uh, wait. Critical? Critical? Did you say critical? I don't know. Yep. Please go. I need you to be my meat shield. My my metal shield. Alright, so this is a big waypoint here. There might be something coming. I'm at location, Commander. Got one of them. Uh send you over there. Let's see how this goes. Also artillery, but I think it's not firing. Ooh, 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 ooh. Get that guy out of the sky quickly. Oh, nice. So, how do we get up there? We gotta go through the lava again, right? And there's another Union class dropship. So cool. Right, we're gonna get you. Made it to your requested location, sir. Mm, no. I'm gonna take the long way around. Following your lead, boss. Let's go over here. I don't like this feeling that something or somebody might come around the corner in an instant and just go for us. Repositioning. So, this is how we do it. Target acquired. There we go. Again, okay, sending in the people first. Status of the Stalker is still extremely good. The awesome as well. 
Our Orion being our brawlier type of mech. I took some damage. It's also the faster mech, so it will naturally just get the quicker into the fight. There's another Union. What's left of one anyway? Mm. What happened here? Another derelict dropship. This one is in much better condition. It's still broadcasting out transponder cords and what appears to be some form of message. But they're both very faint and showing high amounts of signal degradation. I'll begin to run an analysis on both now. Hopefully, it will provide us with some answers. All right, let's go. You can do better. Come on, hit him properly. I gotta do it all myself. So, sending in the commands, the people should move before I go in. Because I wanna have my mech ready when the fight happens, the big fight in the end. The boss fight. Still a long way to go, huh? Eh, I mean, a little bit. Commander. Yep. Go there. We're on the move. By the way, what's here? I think I never went to that spot. I wonder if you can do things here when you have jump jets. Uh, jumping up there out. and then getting into that canyon area. I don't know. Yeah, I think it's not part of the actual mission. RD location requested. Cool. Next. Just saying. Just so. <laughs> He's cool. I like him. Alright, Orion is going in first at this point. Man, you can really, really micromanage if you want to. Quick kills. That's important. Alright. So, what's happening here? This seems like a fight situation. Oh yeah, there was a stalker somewhere. This is a map where we will fight a stalker, I think. Information on the derelict unions. Star League Defense Force, 6th Army, 309th Royal Battleneck Division. There it is. That last ship is broadcasting out a Mayday signal. The 309th Royal famously took part in General Kerensky's exodus from the Inner Sphere. Let's go. Take him out. It's a 3FB, by the way. That thing is great because it comes with an ECM. With the Exodus fleet. Both dropships appear to have been shut down at low Got him. altitudes. Nice. So remarkably, outside of external damage from impacts, most of the ship's contents would have been unharmed in the crash. However, there is noticeable evidence of salvaging. Blimey, the Royal Battlemet divisions were among the elite units of the SLDF, known for fielding the most advanced technology they had available. Yep. That would explain the mechs fielded by these zealots. Easy Even peasy. Even centuries old, the text on those mechs massively outclasses anything on the market today. You should proceed with extreme caution, Commander. I will. Ooh, this is gonna be interesting. I wonder if we're gonna lose something here, because my left arm doesn't look great anymore. But I also don't want my AI pilots to just do the job for me. I think it's not gonna end well. By the way, where is my... God, where's the path up here? I think it's left side, actually. Right? I'm not sure. How do we get up there? I think it might have been this here, and then there's this kind of spiral way up. Let's see. It's really hard to tell when the minimap is not really giving you any cues. Uh, but no, this is not it. Alright, so we have to move further. Come with me, guys. I just led you into a little bit of a <clears throat> weird situation. I really want to salvage that stalker as well, because it is the better stalker uh, compared to the stalker that we have right now. It's just better, plainly better, coming also with that ECM. It's really cool. Ah, this might be the way up. All right. Found it. So what are you? You are destroyed. And another one. And... Eh, whatever. Down. I actually took damage from that explosion. See, I usually don't want to run over those tanks because they will give a bit of splashback damage to you when you stomp on them. 
So uh, stay out of the way. Stay out of the explosion radius. And up we go. So, everybody here? Yeah, I'm gonna wait for those guys. Yo guys, you coming? <laughs> Stalker and Austin being like, Oh no, we cannot fire our weapons up there. What are you doing with us? Ah. <laughs> alright, alright, alright. I'm coming already. You good? Alright, let's do it. Let's get into the, the last fight here. So I think they bring a Victor, they bring an um, Orion. And another thing that I forgot. This is gonna be a tough fight if you let them shoot you a lot. But I think that's true for every fight. Well, I mean, I got my Orion here, that's good. Insolent mercenary, you dare challenge me? If you are here to stop my ascension, you are too late. I will take everything that is precious to the old hag that hired you, but not before crushing you like the insects that I think are. we're gonna hold this choke point. Guys, are you here? I need you. Now. Repositioning. All right, I'm gonna send the repositioning command directly. Let's see if that does something. The awesome seems to have some trouble finding the path. I am the living avatar of death. Oh, here we go. Shoot him! Please! Cyclops it is. Oh my god, it's a Cyclops. We're gonna try to take it down so quickly. But hey, it kind of worked. The Stalker is attracting the fire. We will completely ignore Mr. Phoenix Hawk here because they are bigger fish to fry. Unless there is nobody else to shoot. And then we're gonna take him, obviously. The brawl is on. Yeah, come on, you got him. That Artemis LRM is about to fall. I don't like that. Uh, speaking of like, I'm gonna like to kill you. What about a headshot? You will not get it, right? It's fine. It's fine. Looks like Whitby has met her maker. Great work, Commander. I suspect this wraps up our contract with the will of Kali and our dealings with these heinous zealots. Amen to that. So, the LRM-20 is still there, that's the good news, but it almost fell apart. Man, punching with that is not a good idea, it's not advised. Such a great weapon system, put that on the arm and the AI will just sling it around and punch it into the face of your enemies. <laughs> Which obviously will deal return damage to that arm. I wish I could take it. I wish I could take it, but we cannot, so we won't. Hmm. Do we take one of those Phoenix Hawks? I don't know. I want a Guardian ECM just to have it. There are some double heat sinks just to have them. But other than that, there is nothing that is really interesting here. So we'll take some... Uh, some money. And the money comes in form of... Stuff. <laughs> oh, crap. <laughs> Alright. So, that's gonna be it. And obviously, we're gonna take our Orion here. There we go. Beautiful. Such a good mech. I love it. So, Magdus is gonna get... Swapped is this guy. And we're gonna take this here into... <laughs> into consideration that it's completely and utterly destroyed. But anyway, it has some options, it has some hard points, which I would love to fill with some decent stuff, but that's gonna happen in the next episode of Mech Warrior 5 Mercenary, Legend of the Castro Lancers, and Heroes of the Inner Sphere and everything. Um, still don't know how to mod the game yet and what I want, so if you want to make a decision uh, or help me deciding, then leave a comment down below. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, as always, don't forget to leave a rating, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye.